So we were seeing in Baghdad with Maruf al Kharki along the Tigris when some lowly people passed by in a boat playing tambourines, drinking and just playing around so we would so we so we said to Maruf do you not see how they are openly being disobedient to God? Imprecate against them with God Most High. So he raised his hands and said, O Allah, as you have made them happy in this life, make them happy in the life to come. We said, we ask you to imprecate against them. He said, if he is happy with them in the life to come, he has repented towards them. So, that, that means, means make Tawbah in this Tawbah. Yes. See how people read the wrong, they don't understand God enough to understand what he's saying. And they, 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 these people are the attitude of the average Muslim. Smite them, God. Smite them. Smite them hard. <laughs> Put on CNN and Al Jazeera. Let's see it good. Vengeful. Yeah, vengeance. So, what does imprecate exactly mean? They're asking them to. It means to make a bad, a bad dua. Right? We love that. Muslims live for that. It's one of the things we live for in our Muslim life. Making dua against someone else. But Ma'aruf al karhi an amazing person he was, the Suruhu. This is a beautiful dua, you know, because he's seeing, you know, that, you know, their state and, you know, all, you know Allah can just change it. They take, make tell them, all make them happy in their life. So, you know, give them that Allah. It's, I like that. It's a beautiful. It's a beautiful story.